one of my colleagues used to say, you know, I can teach news writing with a number two pencil and a notebook, right? So we've gone from that to this whole new world of where everything is multimedia. Within journalism, um, we've gone through a sea change over the last 10 years where I started teaching print journalism and then the whole industry changed. And so then we began to uh, create a whole new curriculum uh, combining electronic media and print media into a brand new multimedia journalism curriculum. And once we did that, then we needed to have the equipment with which to train the students. So that was really a challenge at the beginning because the university didn't just have $50,000 right in its back pocket saying, you know, here we've got this money to build this this uh, newsroom, which was basically what we needed. We needed to establish a newsroom type operation with cameras, with video recorders, with audio recorders, with digital still cameras. We've managed then to build this, what I call a teaching hospital model, because that's what Borderzine is. Um, we run it like a newsroom. The kids are working on their stories. They're editing their multimedia stories. They're doing interviews. They're writing up their stories. And, uh, and then we run their material every week. As a print journalist, I never knew how to go out and shoot video and edit video. Well, now every young journalist that comes in the door um, of our uh, program needs to be able to do that by the time they graduate. I tell them with the very first uh, basic media writing class that they take, I say, my goal is for you by the end of this semester, even though it's your first semester as a multimedia student journalist, is to produce something that can be published. Because that's the goal of this program, is to get them to publish while they're still in school. Another very, very strong component of the multimedia journalism program are internships. They need to start getting the hands-on experience while they're still in college so that they can go out there and they can compete with the best and get hired once they graduate. Our first multimedia major did three internships while she was still at UTEP. She did one with the AP in Dallas. She, went, she did one in Washington, D.C. at the Scripps Howard News Bureau. And she did one uh, in Oregon at the Oregonian. And she graduated. And the summer, that summer she graduated, she was at the AP at an internship and the Oregonian called her because she'd already interned there and said, we, we have an op job opening, do you want it? And they hired her. They may not be able to get the dream job right away out of college, but they're getting the skills that then they will be able to parlay into those wonderful job opportunities that are gonna be out there.